What makes or breaks the new NEO ET9? A deep dive. The electric vehicle industry is evolving faster than ever, and one company continues to make waves with its bold innovation, NEO. To understand that, we must start with what sets it apart, its engineering brilliance. The NEO ET9 is more than just a car. It's a technological showcase wrapped in luxury. Built on NEO's newest NT3 platform, the ET9 represents the brand's third-generation architecture. This platform integrates advanced computing power, next-level connectivity, and the foundation for level 4 autonomous driving. The NT3 system ISN T just about performance. It is about creating a digital ecosystem where the car becomes an intelligent companion. At the heart of the ET9 lies one of its biggest selling points, the solid-state battery pack. NEO's solid-state battery has been one of the most anticipated breakthroughs in the EV space. With an impressive 150 kilowatt hour capacity, it promises a range of nearly 1,000 kilometers or roughly 620 miles on a single charge. That's enough to drive from Los Angeles to San Francisco and back without recharging. If those numbers hold up under real-world conditions, it would leap far ahead of most competitors, including Tesla's Model S Long Range and Lucid's Air Grand Touring. But NEO doesn't stop at range. The ET9 is equipped with NEO's brand new Skyride Intelligent Chassis System, a fully active suspension that constantly adjusts damping, roll, and pitch in real time. This allows for an incredibly smooth and stable driving experience, regardless of road conditions. The suspension uses multiple sensors and onboard AI algorithms to predict and adapt to terrain changes before they happen. Whether cruising down smooth highways or navigating uneven city streets, the ET9 maintains impeccable composure. It's like having an invisible co-pilot working to keep every ride effortless. Beyond its mechanical sophistication, the ET9 embodies futuristic design. Its exterior exudes elegance with aerodynamic precision, low drag, sleek curves, and clean lines that enhance both performance and efficiency. The front end features a sharp LED matrix headlight design that blends seamlessly into the body, while the rear sports a continuous light strip that signals innovation and modernity. NEO has managed to make the ET9 look powerful without aggression, blending performance with serenity, a rare balance in modern automotive design. Inside, the story continues. The ET9's interior is where NEO truly flexes its luxury credentials. The cabin feels like a fusion of art and technology, minimalist yet deeply immersive. The interior layout focuses on comfort, space, and digital intelligence. The panoramic smart glass roof floods the cabin with natural light, while sound-insulated materials create a peaceful environment that isolates occupants from the outside world. In the front, Drivers are greeted with a digital cockpit powered by NEO's latest generation infotainment system, controlled by their signature AI assistant, Nomi. Nomi isn't just voice activated, it's adaptive. It remembers driver preferences, learns routines, and personalizes everything from climate control to seat positioning. Over time, it evolves to understand behavior and mood, transforming the ET9 from a machine into a responsive, learning companion. For passengers, particularly those in the rear, the ET9 offers pure indulgence. The rear seats are fully reclinable and come with built-in massage functions, independent climate control, and entertainment displays. It is a car designed for those who value serenity as much as speed, a true executive sedan for the electric age. But no vehicle is perfect. What could break the Neo ET9 are the same challenges that have haunted many groundbreaking technologies. First, price. The ET9 is not just premium, it's ultra-premium. Industry estimates suggest that it will start above $100,000, putting it in direct competition with the Tesla Model S Plaid, Mercedes EQS, Porsche Taycan Turbo, and Lucid Airdream Edition. For a Chinese automaker still establishing its brand prestige globally, that price point may be a hurdle. NEO's build quality and innovation may rival the best, but consumer trust in new luxury entrants takes time to build, especially in Western markets where heritage brands dominate. Second, infrastructure. One of NEO's biggest differentiators is its battery swap technology, allowing users to change depleted batteries for fully charged ones in under five minutes. It's faster than any fast charger, and in theory, it solves the range anxiety problem forever. 
But the challenge is scalability. Most of NEO's battery swap stations are currently in China. Expanding that network into Europe or the United States requires billions in investment, regulatory approvals, and consumer adoption. Without that infrastructure, global customers might not experience the ET9S full convenience, and that could limit its success abroad. Third, competition. The electric luxury segment is getting crowded fast. Tesla continues to dominate public perception. Lucid focuses on efficiency and luxury. Porsche pushes driving dynamics and Mercedes emphasizes refinement and comfort. Every brand is perfecting its niche. Neo, though highly innovative, faces the challenge of convincing buyers that it can compete with brands that have decades of global credibility. Another critical factor that might influence the ET9 success is software and AI reliability. With heavy reliance on digital systems, over-the-air updates, and AI-driven features, any software flaw could directly affect the user experience. Glitches in smart suspension, delayed response from autonomous systems, or connectivity bugs could quickly erode consumer trust, especially in a segment where perfection is expected. Yet, despite these potential hurdles, what could make the ET9 stand out is NEO's ecosystem vision. Unlike most automakers that sell cars, NEO sells an experience, a complete lifestyle around mobility. From battery as a service subscriptions to AI integrated navigation, NEO has created a community-driven ownership model. Users get access to exclusive lounges, premium services, and personalized digital support, transforming the concept of car ownership into something far more connected and human. The ET9 is also a reflection of NEO's broader ambition to establish a sustainable, intelligent transportation ecosystem. The company's investments in autonomous driving, smart manufacturing, and renewable energy partnerships demonstrate a long-term vision that goes beyond selling vehicles. The ET9 is the flagship product of that mission, symbolizing what's possible when design, engineering, and intelligence merge seamlessly. Another aspect that gives the ET9 an edge is its focus on human-centric design. Every feature is built around the driver's and passenger's emotional experience. The car isn't just responsive, it's empathetic. From the smooth vibration of its active suspension to the tone of Nomi's voice, everything feels designed to make driving stress-free and personal. This philosophy might just be the key to Neo's success in a market increasingly driven by emotion as much as technology. Still, the global market presents unpredictable variables. Economic downturns, trade restrictions, or geopolitical tensions could delay Neo's international expansion. In addition, the solid-state battery, while revolutionary, is still untested in mass production. If supply chain issues or safety concerns arise, it could delay deliveries and shake consumer confidence. Ultimately, the NEO ET9 sits at a fascinating intersection of innovation and risk. It represents the pinnacle of what NEO has learned from its earlier models, the ES8, ET7, and ET5, while introducing a level of sophistication that aims to rival Europe's finest luxury sedans. If the ET9 performs as promised, if its range, performance, and AI truly deliver in real-world conditions, it could position NEO as the brand that defines the next generation of electric luxury. But if pricing, software reliability, or infrastructure limitations hold it back, it risks becoming a niche marvel admired but not adopted. In the end, the Neo ET9 story isn't just about an electric car. It's about a company daring to challenge global giants with a vision deeply rooted in intelligence, design, and emotion. It's about redefining what it means to drive or be driven in a world where technology and humanity are becoming one. The Neo ET9 could either mark the dawn of a new era for electric luxury or serve as a reminder of how ambition must meet practicality. Either way, it is a bold statement from NEO to the entire world. The future of driving ISN T just electric. It is intelligent, emotional, and beautifully human.